Apollo 11, the one giant leap for mankind. Apollo 11 was the first space mission to land humans on the moon, taking place from July 16, 24, 1969. The mission launched from Kennedy Space Center in Florida on July 16, 1969, with a Saturn V rocket. Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin became the first humans to walk on the moon on July 20, 1969, after landing the Apollo Lunar Module Eagle. The crew members were Armstrong, Aldrin, and Michael Collins. The lunar module remained on the moon for more than 21 hours before the crew returned to Earth on July 24, 1969. The Apollo 11 mission faced several challenges, including one landing site. The landing site was near the moon's equator, but the center of the landing ellipse was a crater full of boulders. Two, gravity. The moon's gravitational field was irregular and lumpy, which nudged the Apollo command module and lunar module. Three, lunar module separation. When the lunar module separated, it popped like a cork. Four, radar unit. A faulty radar unit bombarded the onboard computer, prompting the computer to keep getting tasks it didn't need to undertake. Five, guidance computer. The computer was overloaded and couldn't focus on the things it needed to for descent and landing. Six, consumables and equipment. The crew lacked all the consumables and equipment needed to walk on the moon. Overcoming difficulties. The astronauts, Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin, had to quickly assess the situation and make decisions, such as continuing the descent manually. They also developed contingency plans to ensure the safety of the astronauts and the success of the mission. At the end, the mission captivated the world, with hundreds of millions of people watching on television in nearly every part of the globe. Armstrong's first step onto the lunar surface was broadcast on live TV to a worldwide audience. He said, that's one small step for a man, one giant leap for mankind. Do you like to do moonwalk and moon, and why Apollo missions stopped? Comment down below.